there is a question of what next tonight? What happens now that a major local employer will be sold? Hundreds of people earn a living from Appleton Coated, a paper plant. NBC 26's Shara Taylor spoke with the wife of one of those workers. They're just one family now worried about their future. He never thought he'd have to apply for a job again in his life. Maria Hans says her husband has worked for Appleton Coated almost 20 years. He's near retirement and has to care for her because of health concerns. When the company was sold, Hans says she wasn't sure what would happen next because there was a chance they could work longer. Initially, they sent us papers from an attorney, which unless you have a law degree, you know, you don't know what they're saying. So we didn't quite understand what was going on. They told us that they would be running until October 16th. Hundreds of employees waited to see if they could return to work after being laid off. There's now a 90 day deadline for a company to buy the mill and keep it open. There's certainly, there are some kernels of good news there, um, but you know, this isn't, you know, this isn't what we were hoping for exactly, but we do have a second chance and that's important. Appleton Coated workers are still hoping they can return to work here despite the company being sold to a liquidation company. Meanwhile, Chance's husband looks for work. He's been like waking up at five o'clock in the morning and checking his phone. He's um, registered with the career builder and Indeed and all of the, you know, for the new jobs and uh, he's struggling. I mean, he didn't even know how to get online and do all that stuff. Reporting in Combined Locks, Shara Taylor, NBC 26.